Stories with Jess Lujan. Good evening, Guam. I'm Jess Lujan. Welcome to this edition of The Buzz. Exciting show tonight. Um, controversial. Um, a recent bill that just passed regarding road closure, given the authority for the mayors to, to close the road in their prospective municipalities. Tonight we have Mayor from uh, Jigo, Mayor Bob Lizama. Mayor, good evening. Hi, good evening, Jess. And also the Executive Director of the uh, Mayor's Council of Guam, Angel Sablan. Here yes. for, you were here a couple, couple weeks ago. Yeah. Well, let's, Always let's, happy to be here. <laughs> let's go ahead and start off. Um, Mayor, um, you were a former policeman, a retired of that. Uh, you dealt with traffic in and out, and I, I, I've seen your handling of your village as well. At, at times, you've, you've had to um, block off some lanes be for, for the safety of not only the, 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 the folks that were utilizing parts of the roads, but also for, the, for driver safety. Please tell us the genesis of, of how this came about, and looks like there's going to be an amended bill pretty soon that will take that authority away. Please get well, the thank you. Thank you, Jesse, for the, uh, the opportunity, mm -hmm. you know, uh, for inviting me here, of course, to uh, be part of the uh, show tonight. Mm -hmm. And yes, you know, it's been uh, controversial, but it's mm -hmm. only controversial for one individual, of course, that continues to, uh, you know, ramrod the whole uh, issue. Mm -hmm. You know, as I say again, you know, that uh, it had its fair hearing, and uh, we want to thank, of course, the... Uh, the uh, sponsor of the bill was Senator B.J. Cruz, mm -hmm. you know, who had sponsored the bill and uh, heard the, uh, the call of the mayors. Mm -hmm. You know, this really all started as a result of a uh, letter that came from the Attorney General's office uh, uh, telling us, actually, uh, you know, that we are not given any authority to block off roads, if mm -hmm. you will, uh, nor uh, is there anything in the books that says that we can't. Mm -hmm. So with that, we worked with the uh, legislature, and uh, uh, here we are. To get some clarity. Yeah, to basically. get some clarity, basically, of course. And uh, we had the uh, Guam legislature, of course, introduce uh, uh, here, actually, um, the bill itself, 341-31, uh, Committee mm -hmm. on Rules. And then uh, a public hearing was afforded back mm -hmm. in November 14, mm -hmm. uh, 2011. Uh, with that, uh, it came out seven, uh, seven uh, uh, yeas and three nays, mm -hmm. you know, uh, and, of course, the bill passed. Mm -hmm. uh, and, and with that... Uh, it went to the governor's office, mm -hmm. and and with that, the acting governor at the time, uh, when um, acting, uh, the uh, lieutenant governor Ray Tenorio mm -hmm. was the uh, mm -hmm. acting governor. He found it, uh, you know, and sided uh, with the with the uh, majority uh, that voted mm -hmm. at the legislature and heard the voice of the mayors mm -hmm. and the vice mayors of Guam. Mm -hmm. You know that we need to have at least some uh, teeth in uh, some some law mm -hmm. that will authorize the mayors. You know, so that we are clearly now given that authority. Uh, and with that, uh, the acting governor uh, at the time, uh, uh, Lieutenant Governor Ray Tenorio, signed it and it became public law, 31-188. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. And, you know, with all this that's happening now, we are at this juncture that uh, we're hearing all over the, the, the media, of course, that, uh, you know, the uh, federal highway funds now is being threatened mm -hmm. or perhaps uh, may be threatened, you know, as a result of uh, the law uh, giving the, the mayors and the vice mayors the authority. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And yes, you're right, you know, uh, I did serve in the Guam Police Department, mm -hmm. and incidentally, I, I served and I worked as a patrol officer, as a sergeant in the Guam Police in the Tumun, Tumuning, mm -hmm. Hagatnya areas. Mm -hmm. And, you know, interesting that many times the roads that were blocked, we were assisting as police officers, mm -hmm. assisting the mayors, okay, yes, yeah. you know, uh, to block these roads, mm -hmm. and we were assisting them at times with cones, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you know, or any type of barriers that we may have, just, sure, to, sure. To, just to help, sure. you know, with whatever, be it... Uh, mm -hmm. Uh, a function, uh, a gathering, mm -hmm. if you will. Uh, let's go further. Even yeah. political gatherings sure. at times, sure. you know, we sure. would block off. You know, but there was never a time, you know, when the uh, director was disturbed and bothered at that when she mm -hmm. was serving in our island for mm -hmm. 12 years. Mm -hmm. You know, and now that uh, she holds the directorship, I think it's important that she realize that, you know, what was good in the past is not good now that she's in the, in the helm of being the director, and it's mm -hmm. not personal, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you know. I never mentioned about relative in mm -hmm. this whole issue, mm -hmm. as it was mentioned in one talk show. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, um, I stand firm, and I, uh, I, I appreciate, of course, the effort that the uh, acting governor had mm -hmm. signed it into law to give the mayors, because, mm -hmm. you know, not only Jigo is impacted, mm -hmm. uh, Senator um, uh, Jess, uh, I do have uh, occasions that we do close uh, the routed roads, and that's uh, Route 1 and Route 29. Mm -hmm. That's when we have our annual event. Sure. But that's once a year, mm -hmm. you know. So why are we 
hollering so loud. <laughs> Mayor and, uh, <laughs> and Angel, we'll be right back. We're going to take a quick break, and we got a lot to say, and um, let's, let, let's talk about liberation coming up as well. Hey, that's a major road closure. <laughs> Are you going to have the authority to do that? <laughs> we'll be right back. <laughs>